And today is the summer solstice, the longest day of the year. Well, they're all 24 hours, but this one has the most sunshine. And for organizers with visiting angels, it's their longest day event. It's really special. It recognizes the caretakers of those with Alzheimer's who navigate the daily challenges of dealing with the disease alongside their loved ones. Six News reporter Mike Rogers was at the event today and has more on their mission. From sun up to sundown, volunteers with Visiting Angels, a private caregiver service, work tirelessly to give a voice to those who give their love and time. It's a great cause, um, you know, bringing awareness not only to the disease itself, but to the caregivers. Number two cook Jeff Davison was once a caregiver for his grandfather, who had Alzheimer's. On Thursday, he manned the grill to give back to those whose struggles he knows all too well. So it takes a tremendous amount of patience to care for him, as well as an understanding of the disease and what's actually going uh, you know, through them with what they're going through at the time. Through their pre-ordered meals of sausage and eggs in the morning and burgers during the day, the group hopes to raise over $16,000 for the Alzheimer's Association. When you meet someone who's going through it um, and really needs the resources that we offer, uh, it, it, it makes you smile because you know at that time you're actually able to help. Arthur Brewer is the Alzheimer's Association Capital of Texas Chapter Development Director. He says the money will go towards care, support, and research for a cure. Recently, we had a new drug get through the FDA advisory committee, so that's being on track to go towards uh, FDA approval. For Davison, the work on the grill is worth it to support the many people dedicated to serving those with Alzheimer's. This is one of those causes that's really important to try to get their, everybody to get our arms around, so uh, to help a lot of people, you know, deal with it and also hopefully find a cure. Reporting, Mike Rogers, 6 News. And they're still cooking tonight until sundown, so you could go get dinner over in the Hilton Garden Inn parking lot in Temple. Coming up on 6-2.